Hey guys, today's August 16th. Um, I want to tell you of some stuff that I found out. I was reading some articles today, and they were actually, one was out from yesterday, and one was out today. Um, and yes, I'm going to be back on this topic because it's important, uh, about the 5G. Um, I'm going to read you some of the stuff um, about it, and then I'm going to read you some scriptures pertaining to to this so this might be a long video um we all know what 5g is okay but the thing that i found interesting nikki thank goodness he uh talked to me about this because he's been really good at confirming stuff um verizon wants 5g to become a serious competitor to broadband internet and it thinks free tv will do the trick Okay, so the telecom company will start selling 5G service later this year, and it won't appear in smartphones for some time next year, but will be fast enough to provide internet service to a home. Now, this is what got me. It says to entice customers to sign on, Verizon will offer a kind of double play service that Comcast and its competitors offer television. Now, the enticing is like bringing someone in, manipulating them, right? And we already know that 5G is mind control, okay? And this just came out yesterday, okay? Um, and it says, partnering with Apple, AAPL, and Google, Verizon will give 5G internet customers a choice, YouTube TV service or an Apple TV. Now, um, a lot of us have ministries on our YouTube channel, um, I'm just going to tell you now, don't get anything with 5G um, that comes out as fascinating, as amazing as it is. It is a weapon, okay, that is used by the government. Um, and that is fact. That's not an opinion. That is fact. I'm going to get into this because this gets pretty deep. Um, but it says... Um, Verizon has not an announced the terms publicly, okay, to these terms, but Bloomberg reports that the Verizon will offer them free, which is the TVs. The 5G double play offer is particularly notable because Verizon has resisted media mergers. AT&T launched Watch TV, a free live television package for, a, for 4G customers, days after it brought, bought Time Warner. Verizon wants to stick digital with its Yahoo and AOL businesses. That could give AT&T a leg up. AT&T, which owns CNN, is Verizon's biggest 5G competitor. Okay, and the thing that got me was the CNN. CNN is our news, okay, our news channel and stuff. And I actually have AT&T and I love it. But after finding out that AT&T is next to bring this out, I might be giving up complete service altogether. Um, and with how much I've been praying and stuff, I I know that this year and into next year is a very bad year that's coming. Um, but there's some good news that I will say about it, okay? Um, now, I live in Indiana. I live by Illinois, okay? I'm like maybe 10 miles from the border uh, of Illinois, okay? And it says... Um, and it's launching its 5G network in several U.S. cities this year, okay? And like I said, this just came out yesterday. Um, it includes Charlotte, Dallas, Oklahoma City, Atlanta, Verizon announced Tuesday, okay, that it has ended Indianapolis, added Indianapolis as its fourth 5G city, joining Houston, Los Angeles, and Sacramento. AT&T hasn't announced its package as of yet. Um, I'm two hours away from Indianapolis. So um, our next major city from India is Lafayette. And um, there's quite a bit of people out. And people are already crazy around here as it is. I can just imagine what is going to happen the second they bring that out, which is this year. And it will be compatible. It's going to be on hotspots and stuff before the phones. The phones um, is more so next year. Okay, so what if this 5G 
uh, is what's going to cause the nation's EMP attack because of the electromagnetic pulse and radiation frequencies that it's causing, right? Um, it's causing man, therefore, to experiment more, like with CERN. CERN already opened its portals, and it's already caused um, problems in our atmosphere, and it's brought demons down. Um, what's that place? It's over in another country. Oh, I know somebody's going to be able to tell me. I thought it started with the M. Um, not Morocco. But anyways, um... This was like a couple years ago when CERN opened it. It brought down the demons because of the Ark of Baal. Baal, B-A-A-L, Baal. Maybe that's how you pronounce it, which is biblically spoken of. Um, and it, since they're experimenting with CERN, you know, the government is having its um, control over it, right? And it's what it's going to do, since it already has an effect, okay, on us humans, it's going to be used as a complete weapon, and it will be complete mind controlled, okay? Because we know that as soon as the demons come down, um, the, as soon as this portal opened, everything started changing. It started altering some some way. And we noticed that, like, even with celebrities, they all started acting weird. We've seen that they, some of them are reptilian and things of that nature. Well, it, they started mind controlling officially in the 1950s, right? And it, that's with going on with its phone usages and things like that. But... Has anybody out there seen the actual, it's called The Simpsons Movie? Okay, I used to be a big fan of The Simpsons. Okay, um, and what that movie is, it's completely talking about the government controlling us. Okay, and it's, I, of course, it's all taken in Springfield, Illinois, but um, they, they are, the government controlled them by putting them in a bubble. And they couldn't get in and they couldn't get out and they had complete control over the people, okay? And you see that they targeted certain cities. That's exactly what 5G is doing. They're targeting certain cities right now, the major big cities. All right, now AI is also part of the beast system, which we already know that artificial intelligence and plays into the 5G part of it. Why do you think they call it artificial intelligence? Artificial is a man-made thing by intelligence, by our brain, okay? Um, it is made corrupt. Um, it is to alter DNA, and it has complete mind control setting. 5G uses 28, 37, and 39 millimeter wave spectrum, which comes from the term fifth, excuse me, generation, which is designed to work in conjunction with what the, excuse me, goodness, the former CIA head David Patriots calls the Internet of Things or IoT. The agenda is to hook every single material thing on the planet as well as human beings themselves onto a vast planet-wide web where everything and everyone becomes nodes on the network connected by microchips which are nano-sized and can be inhaled like small dust. That is completely dangerous in itself. And the word that stuck out to me is vast, okay? Because when God created the earth, it was vast, and right? It was void. It didn't have anything, okay? So when God made man, he put us in charge, okay? Like, we're the ones that need God. He gave us our own free mind, our own free will. So therefore... Man has discovered how to alter and control people, okay? Now, um, okay, it says 5G is not merely an upgrade of wireless infrastructures. It is a giant leap towards the erection and installation of a total technological control grid. It's agenda to cover the whole entire world. It's so its effects cannot be escaped by anyone on the planet. And I 100% agree with that. 5G will be harder to shield the radiation. Okay, 5G radiation will be harder to uh, be shielded against because they're going to have more radioactive towers in every corner. And what's worse is they will be able to shell, share its frequencies with the military, which is controlling them, which is very deadly, okay? And I want you guys, what I just said here, to keep that in mind because I have scripture to go along with this, what 
about this military being controlled. That is the most dangerous thing because they are supposed to protect us when in reality they're the ones that's going to be able to um, be controlled. Um, and I believe that's what's going to cause these wars with Israel. Okay, now, it is also because of them bowing down to the beast system. Now, I am exaggerating you not it is a uh, 350 my time at 306 i was sitting here writing down information studying doing my bible study and my power went complete out and i was like oh my gosh and it says 306 and what i what 306 means um to put off postpone it's amethyst and it also means speed of light i believe this was god's way of confirming what is about to happen an EMP. Okay. So 5G was announced in the summer of 2016. Um, so I don't know who that is. I'm sorry. Um, but the summer of 2016, which is three years before it was supposed to come out. And we know three is confirmation. Okay, an EMP now, what does this have to do with anything? It is an electromagnetic pulse, which affects hardware, which is in return and will affect the power grid. This is a super energetic radio wave that can destroy, damage, or cause the malfunction of electronic systems by overloading their circuits. An EMP weapon detonation, detona detonated at high altitude would be harmless, harmless to people, but catastrophic to our critical infrastructures, electric power grid, telecommunications, transportation, banking and financing, food and water. And if that happens, it will take 12 months to kill 90% of the population and we are not prepared for it. Okay. Now a solar storm can cause large geomatic, geo, magnetic disturbances on earth these occur about every 150 years september 1st through 2nd of 1859 is when the solar storm occurred and it was very damaging which is exactly 159 years ago it's caused or it's known as a cme as well and a cme is a coronal mass ejection which did occur july 14th of 2017 lasting almost two hours can you imagine what the next one is going to do okay and my point here is this Certain types of high energy explosions, such as a nuclear explosion, will cause an EMP. Likewise, an EMP can be the result of a suddenly fluctuating magnetic field. It can be the result of a CME from solar activity. Now, I'm going to read to you Revelations 16, verses 8 and 9, 10 and, 10 and 11. And it says, Revelations 16. Okay. says this then the fourth angel poured out his bow on the sun and the power was given to him to scorch men with fire and men were scorched with great heat and they blasphemy the name of god who has the power over those plagues and they did not repent and give him glory okay then it goes on about the fifth angel poured out his bowl on the throne of the beast and his kingdom became full of darkness, and they gnawed their tongues because of the pain. They blasphemed the God of heaven because their pains and their sores, and they did not repent of their deeds. I could go on and on and on. This is talking about a, a CME type solar flare event that would be occurred from the sun. And I believe that would be from the 5G because it has radiation and it has its power that will affect our grid. And therefore the grid okay, can be affected through nuclear and nuclear is affected by mankind. And mankind is going to be mind controlled all because of this one system that they have complete control over, which is going to affect, therefore, the whole entire universe. Okay. Um, Revelation 13, 16, we know it says about the beast, how the chip right here. Okay. And it says, he causes all, both small and great, rich and poor, free and slave, to receive a mark on their right hand or on their forehead, and then that no one may buy or sell except one who has the mark of the name of the beast or the number of his name. 
Okay, Ver Revelations 12 and 13 go completely together. Okay, no Revelations is not completely in chronological order. Okay, because it's one of the most hardest books in the Bible to understand. But I am telling you, as the Revelation 12 sign has occurred, okay, before the birth pains begin, you know, we are taken out of the way and then Satan is there trying to grab a hold of this male child, but it flees into the wilderness, okay. Now, there is a lot um, of this occurrences, um, solar flare, CMEs, and stuff that's spoken of in the Bible in, um, uh, not oxymorons, but parables, I would say more so, okay, um, because we are now waiting on the Antichrist, okay, and the Antichrist we know gets 42 months, but we will not be here for that, what I'm staying on this, okay, is for the next three years, okay, that Satan is going to be here, okay, through AI and the beast system, they are going to be able to mind control people, okay, through this 5G. I do believe this is the year of the rapture. I do believe that. Um, by the summer, some time, I, I don't know the day or hour. I just know it's any time. Now, um, the, these scriptures are leading into mid-trib all the way to the end of the tribulation with these occurrences through this network that's going to happen. Now, this message that I am speaking is not just for me, but it is for um, others as well. Pardon me a moment. Um, so Joel 2.31, Acts 2.20, God tells us to watch and pay attention to the signs in the sun, moon, and stars as it will come like a thief in the night. Matthew 24 and Revelation 13. First Peter 4.7 says, but the end of all things is at hand. Be ye therefore sober, sober and watch and unto prayer. Now Luke 21, 25 and 26 tells us there will be signs in the sun, moon and stars on the earth. Nations will be in anguish and perplexity at the roaring and tossing of the sea. People will faint from terror, apprehensive of what is coming on the earth for the heavenly bodies will be shaking. He's saying what is coming upon the earth, which we know is through this 5G network. So I'm telling you to watch and pray Jesus Christ is coming and so is this network and it is the most dangerous, dangerous thing that is coming to alter people and their mindsets. So read these verses, Ephesians 4, 20 through 24, but you have not so learned Christ if indeed you have heard him and have been taught by him as the truth is in Jesus, that you put off concerning your former conduct, the old man, which grows corrupt according to the deceitful lust and be renewed in the spirit of your mind and that you can put on the new man, which was created according to God in the righteousness and holiness, Jeremiah 32, 39. Then I will give them one heart and one way that they may fear me forever, that the good of them and their children after them. Okay? What you know now, keep it to heart. Take your old self, okay, who's believing all these lies on the earth, and get rid of it. Don't have anything to do with the powers of darkness because it is going to deceive you and alter you and break you down from God, what God has created you to be. Be who... God has showed you to be. Have the understanding and the connections in the Bible. And he is the one that will protect you and keep you from this. But if therefore you choose not to understand, know therefore that there is scripture out there to help you through the tribulous times. Okay? So this stuff is very important. Just pray over this as always and God bless.